Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I will show you how to build e-commerce website or how to use open cart for beginners. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. Now we all know creating your own website and basically using it as a way for you to sell your products can be kind of frustrating especially if you don't know what are the tools that you can use. Well OpenCart here can actually aid you on that specific problem. Now OpenCart here like Shopify if you're familiar with Shopify is an e-commerce platform where in this case you could basically create your own website or your e-commerce website for free now they have a free plan here that we could use and even a cloud or open cart cloud that we could basically try for seven days now just to give you information uh, this is going to be an e-commerce website that we could build so there's a few things that we could do here and as well there are going to be a few prerequisites for us to follow for us to start using their services so first thing that we need to do here is we need to create our account so go ahead and open up any browser here, go to opencart.com and from here click on the register button at the top right of your screen. Now in here it's going to load up the registration page for OpenCart but first it's going to check the uh, connection that we have right now for a secure connection. So once it actually loads up it's going to request you to enter your information. So in this case, uh, we need to provide our username here, our first name, last name, email, and the country that we are currently for or where your store is actually located, and a password that we want to use or nominate for our account. Now in this case, you need to provide all this information, but once you provided that, click on the appropriate shopping cart option here and click on register. Now in this case, let's go ahead and fill out those necessary details. Now in this case, let's go ahead and click on register to start the registration process. This, so this may take some time, so just wait for it to start the initiate the process. But in this case, once it actually uh, is done, it's going to say, welcome to open cart, your account has been created. So a mail will be actually sent to your uh, your gmail account or whatever email that you actually use here you need that to basically uh, verify your account now in this case go ahead and go to your account or mailing account here so since i use google here i'm going to go to gmail here and from here i want to go ahead and look for open card so let me just check if this is correct here so in this case, just wait for it to appear here, but sometimes some email would actually get lost. So I would suggest you to check your spam folder for any of those. So as you can see, I can see the open card email here on my spam. Now in this case, click on the verify button here to verify your account. But once it's actually verified, it's going to say account has been successfully verified and hit on continue. Now once you hit on continue, it's going to ask you to log in. So in this case, let's go ahead and enter all the SI details here. So let me just enter my password. Now, once you've entered your password and logged in, it's going to say set up your PIN for your account. Now, setting up PIN for your account is a great way for you to further protect your account because PINs are just a great way to uh, further verify if that's you. So let's go ahead and enter a PIN here that we want to use. And once you set up your PIN, you should be able to see this section here. So in this case, there are going to be tools that we could actually uh, use here uh, that we could change. So in this case, we have our account. So in the account section, we have account details, payment methods, partner up. So become a, apply to become a partner on their program. So if you click on this one, typically it's going to reject you to the partner section. So you need to uh, basically submit your application here if you want to be a partner of OpenCard. Now, also, we have the change password option here and showcase. Submit your store to open cards showcase. So if you want to brag about your store and once you build it up, you can go ahead and do that as well. Now, under purchases, you have your orders here, which in this case, you'll be able to view your orders and even your stores, your stores here. So you need to uh, basically, uh, you'll be able to see your stores here, your downloads, your rate, or rate your or downloads here as well. Here we have extensions, so you have the capabilities of managing extensions here and even uh, become a seller. So get paid by selling your work here. 
So here we have the cloud stores here. So you need to, uh, if you want to open up your stores, like for uh, cloud stores is where you'll be able to see it. You have your invoices and cloud domains. Now, in this case, if you want to start uh, creating your website or e-commerce platform here, what you need to do here is you need to go to the download section. So for us to uh, properly use OpenCart here, we need to download their application. So we have the option here to open your cloud store here. So if you want to open your cloud store, but you also have the option to download and host your own uh, option or um, e-commerce website here. Now, we also have the easy setup by their hosting partner here, A2 Hosting here, if you only need to host a website. But in this case, you just need to download this one and they also have instructions here on how to install OpenCart. So in this case, you just need to download OpenCart here, whatever you need in this section here. And you just need to upload your files through server once it's actually set up. And you just need to basically run the automatic installer. And from there, you should be able to set up your uh, website here. Also, there are going to be minimum requirements for your website, like for example, a web server Apache, which is suggested for it. We have PHP, at least 5.4. We have the curl enabled and database, which is MySQL Lite, and which is actually suggested here. We also have the uh, extensions here if you want to install those, but but some of them are actually play, uh, paid, so if you want them, you need to pay for them. Now, also, in this section here, you should be able to uh, view your cloud stores as well. So if you want to open up your cloud store here, you go and click on that. And from here, you should be able to see your cloud source. Now for you to open a cloud store here, it, it, this one is actually going to be paid. So if you want to open up a cloud store, you need to add your payment method first. And from here, cl click on add payment method, add our, either a credit card or people here. So if you choose credit card here, you just need to enter your card details. So that includes your card number, expiration date, and CVV and store your credit card information here. Now also, you also have the option to become a seller here. So if you have teams or extensions that you wanna sell, well, you could become or apply a seller here. So this is a great way for you to also earn on the platform or from OpenCard itself. So it's going to give you the details on how to become a seller here. So upload the team or extension to the extension section and set how much you want to sell your team or extensions. Then from there, you need to uh, be, uh, the payment will be made after the amount of your sales is at least 20 USD. So depending on how you set that extension or team, you'll be able to earn a certain amount. And once you get $20 here, you'll be able to basically pay it or you'll be, you'll be paid for that. Also, that every time you uh you team extension is sold, OpenCart will receive fifty percent commission. So whatever you actually earn on OpenCart here, fifty percent of that will be go will be going to OpenCart, and fifty fifty percent of that is will be going to you. Now, in this case, you will be paid with uh, for each extensions or team here at the very end of the month, and you could also view your. Uh, buys or so if someone or you give you every time someone actually buys your team extensions on the transaction page and uh, the rating of the module is updated only after five reviews left by customers so you'll only be able to see your review on that specific uh content so may it be for extensions or team they will it's all going to be updated for its rating after five customers now, in this case, there's going to be a few information you need to provide here. So go ahead and provide all those details. Choose a payment method that you want to add here. Like if you want to get uh, paid by PayPal, Pioneer, or Add Cash here, just include that. And once you've uh, done that, just click on Submit here. Also, don't forget to upload your work here and manage your extensions. So if you uh, add extensions here and whatnot, make sure that you upload them. But yeah, so that's the basic usage here or the beginner's guide for using OpenCard. But that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.